everybody! I'm here today to answer the simple car question of what does sport mode do on a car? I'll be giving you an easy explanation and demonstrating with the sport mode on this vehicle. Let's get right into the video. Now every car is going to be different, but I'm speaking about the majority of average cars that have a sport mode, okay? What it's going to do is it's going to give it a sportier feel and a sportier sound. And I'll tell you how it accomplishes that. It usually doesn't unlock any extra horsepower. It just makes better use of the horsepower that you already have. So if I put my car in sport mode right now, okay, what it's going to do, and I'll start driving, what it's going to do is it's going to keep it in a lower gear for longer. So regularly, if it would switch gears from first to second, okay, it might keep it in first gear. Or if it would regularly switch from second to third at a lower RPM, it's going to keep it in second gear. What that does is it gives you easier access to the horsepower. So if I floor it now, I get the horsepower much faster simply because simply because I'm accessing that power much faster. Does it mean that I'm getting horsepower that, you know, isn't there in drive mode? In this car, as far as I know, that's not the way that it works. It just makes sure that it stays in gear so you get that sound as it stays in a higher RPM in a lower gear. In addition, it's going to give you access to that horsepower a little bit faster because you're in a lower gear. So the way that it works is, in a lower gear, you have more access to power in general. So if I have a car and I'm driving in first gear at 30 kilometers an hour versus second gear at 30 kilometers an hour, in first gear, I'm gonna have more power when I push the gas pedal the same amount as in second gear. So first gear versus second gear, same speed, same pushing of the gas pedal, first gear gives me more acceleration. So right now, I'm in sport mode and it's, keeping it in a low gear, it's revving at 2,500 RPM, when usually it would have already shifted and I would be revving at let's say 1,500 RPM. And this is even more exaggerated when I'm, at, when I'm actually in uh, at a higher speed. I was only going like 30 kilometers an hour there. So basically it keeps it in a lower gear, which allows it to rev higher, which sounds better, and being in the lower gear gives you more access to the horsepower faster it's right at your foot right at your foot pedal your footprint over there so basically that's all that sport mode does in most cars in some cars like I have a cousin who has a, a high-end sports car in his car it adjusts the entire way that the car performs you know in some cars it might even open up um, some exhaust ports to you know if you have, if you have like a butterfly valve on the car to give it a way sportier sound it all depends on the vehicle but I will tell you one thing you know, in most cars, the sport mode, unless it's like a crazy sporty car, is just gonna give you more access to easier access to the horsepower that you already have and just a better sound to the engine that you already have in that car. That's it, it's all that it does. It's cool to use, but it usually does consume more gas because you're staying in a lower gear for longer. And that's it, if you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.